taking a while to connect, Kent. Uh, what do you call I it? Yeah, a times. yeah, I figured uh, you were on the road by now. Uh, if you were going to make uh, make it on time, you had to be. Uh, uh, it's going to be close. Yeah. Uh, Especially, uh, did you get my message? You got severe weather hit, uh, coming your way. Uh, oh, well, uh, rain? No, more than that. Tornadoes. What's it? In Philly? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, you know, they got tornadoes. Uh, yeah, you didn't think so, right? Uh, uh, from tornado line coming from uh, basically Richmond, Virginia, going up through New York City, straight through Philly. Uh, it, you're gonna you're doing that 81 route. You said you you mentioned to me 8176. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, I'm five miles away from from making that decision, but I I mean, yeah. I look at the uh, Google. Go ahead. Uh, uh, do it uh, because yeah. 81, 81 runs through mountains and tornadoes don't touch down uh, in mountainous areas, uh, you know, nine, 99 times out of 10. Uh, it, they'll, they'll, they'll cross over it. Uh, the, uh, uh, you know, you're, you're in worse shape if you're on 95. Uh, so uh, I definitely I would say take, take 81. And 76. Even though 76, that stretch that goes from 81 across Pitt to Philadelphia, it's crap. Uh, and uh, plus, what do you uh, mean? It's just a piece of shit road. It's not well maintained, and uh, uh. it's old. Uh, and uh, and plus, it's got tolls. Uh, and I don't know what they're charging these days uh, on that stretch. That's the Pennsylvania Turnpike. Uh, but Still, take that route. There's going to be better than the, uh, what do you call well, it? Well, I'm worried right now. Yeah, I, I was just thinking about what's going to be quicker. Because, uh. It'll be quicker. I looked at, you know, it'll definitely be quicker. Uh, you know, the traffic, yeah, you, know, you know, you've already got, i already been over to the radar. You've already got good precip coming down uh, in uh, Philadelphia and Washington, that whole area. So that's going to slow the traffic down there to begin with, uh, even before you get a lot of uh, vehicles on the road. And, uh, you know, you're much better off on the uh, taking the outer route. Uh, you know, 30 miles difference is not significant. That was, that was actually 40. Uh, I look, when I looked this morning, I looked at, I plugged both routes into Google Maps and, and got the ETA, and it was only like 10 minutes difference. Uh, at five in the morning, even though it was 41 miles, 8176, it was only 10 more minutes different on my ETA, yeah. and I, and that's at five o'clock, so that's not going to do anything but get a hell of a lot worse in the you know watch it in the DC Baltimore area, Philly area, you know what I mean? That whole route would just be jammed up. Absolutely. So I was like, fuck, man, 40 miles, and I stay out of DC, and Baltimore, and stay pretty much north of Philly. I mean, I, I just was like, man, that's a no-brainer. Yeah. Even it, it, it's it's going to cost me more in fuel. It's going to cost me more in tolls, probably. But I might be able to still get this fucking load there on time. Yeah, yeah. You know, I, I think you still got a good shot at. It. Let me. The camera's going. 